Technology is everywhere these days. Most of the time it makes life easier, but instant and constant access to so much information, such as the latest news and world events, can also lead to high stress levels, anxiety, and eventually poor health. Social media is another example. There's so much info to sort through that you have to stay on your toes, and it takes time to sort it all out. You never get a break from the unending battle of us versus them. With all this marvelous tech, wouldn't it be nice if you could use technology to reduce your stress and anxiety instead of constantly increasing it? Well, guess what? You can! In this video, I'm going to show you an up-and-coming technology that's cheap, easy to use, fits in your pocket, and can melt away stress and anxiety in 10 minutes a day. Hi, and welcome back to Scotty's Tech.info. I'm Scotty with my co-host Cletus the Tribble. Our story begins with something called the vagus nerve. No, not that vagus. This vagus nerve goes from your noggin all the way down into your body. In fact, it's the longest nerve you have. It's part of the autonomic nervous system, the system that automatically regulates tons of functions in your body, like breathing, digestion, sweating, and so on. It's also part of the parasympathetic system, which is the system that calms you down after certain stressful events. Many studies have shown that stimulating the vagus nerve can reduce inflammation and pain, increase relaxation, and even prevent or help diseases like arthritis, heart disease, depression, migraines, fibromyalgia, and just about anything else you can think of. Because the vagus nerve is involved in so many different processes in your body, it's actually the perfect target to help you reduce stress and anxiety. If you've ever done controlled breathing or meditation, you already know how to stimulate your vagus nerve and chill the heck out. But sometimes even that's not enough. Newsweek, for example, reported that after COVID hit the scenes, the usage of anti-anxiety medications in the USA increased by 34%. So what's the solution? Check it out. This is a TENS device. TENS stands for Transcutaneous Electrical Nerve Stimulation. These gizmos are often used for building muscle, electrical massage, and pain relief. But if you set it correctly, you can also use it to zap your stress. Now, this unit cost me about $39, and for about an extra $11, I got a set of ear clips, which you're going to need. So for $50, both my wife and I can zap away our stress at the same time in just 10 minutes a day. So, here's how it works. The first thing you're going to do is slide the cover all the way off, and you stick your 9-volt battery in. Again, I'll put links in the description to all these goodies. And when you slide this panel down, you notice you have some little buttons here, so... Uh, you've got two outputs here, so you can do two people at a time for Vegas 10s. I'm just going to turn this knob on just to activate the display. And you're going to see it's set for normal mode, which you set with the mode button, and 10 hertz and 100 microseconds. We want to press the little frequency button there, and we want to set that to... We're going to start with 25 hertz, and then we want... This is the frequency, this is the pulse width. For our pulse width, we want 200 microseconds. Now, you don't have to understand what all that means, just bear with me. So now it's set correctly for Vegas 10s, and what we're going to do is, it comes with a, a cable here. You take one of these cables, you plug it into the left side, and on the other end, you see you have these two electrodes. So the red one is going to go into our ear clip, this is a clip that goes on your ear, and you just stick that in there like that. And the black one is going to go to one of these, these sticky pads that have a little wire coming off. So you just insert that in there. Right. So you're ready to go. Now what you're going to do is take this sticky pad, peel it off, and stick it on the back of your left shoulder. It's important to use the left side of your body. So sticky pad on the back of your left shoulder, and the ear clip is going to go, you guessed it, on your ear. Now, this is the actual, this is plastic here, and this is where the juice is actually going to come out, so you want to take this part and put it on the inside of your ear. Uh, there's various techniques of doing this. Just get it inside your ear, like the image here shows, and uh, you'll be fine. Then what you're going to do to turn it on is flip the little cover up here, and you see this, this goes from zero to eight. You're going to turn this on, and when you do, you'll notice the display comes on. You have it set to 25 hertz, 200 microseconds, and you're going to turn it up. Don't turn it up past three. What you're going to want to do here is turn it up to 
probably just before three, when you feel like a tingling, buzzing sensation on your ear, turn it back down. And you want it so that you can just barely feel anything at all. And then you close the little protective lid so you don't bump the knob, and you sit for 10-15 minutes. The device will gently and continuously emit low voltage and low current pulses that will quite literally electrically calm your nerves. Most people start sighing deeply. Some people say like, oh my god, I felt like I just melted into my couch. Uh, in any case, you should feel profound relaxation and calmness. Various studies have shown that the frequency you set it to can be anywhere from 1 hertz all the way up to 30. So uh, most people I know who've done it do between 20 and 30. That's why I say start with 25. If you don't find that you're, you're being very relaxed, you can turn the frequency down by like a few hertz at a time until you find a, the, the exact frequency that works perfectly for you. One study critical of Vegas 10s noted that more research is needed. The results are pretty darn good, but it's fairly new and more studies are needed to determine optimal settings for treating different conditions. Having said that, I just love this thing because it works super, super well. Before I started, I asked my doctor about it and said, hey, is this okay? And she said, yeah, sure, go ahead. In fact, I use one myself. She did warn me not to turn the knob up too high because it is possible to hurt yourself and possibly do nerve damage if you turn it up really, really high. Also, anyone with a pacemaker or certain other medical conditions like heart disease or severe diabetes should be extra careful and definitely consult your doctor first. But for me, as I say, it's been nothing less than magical. I'll leave links to everything down in the description. Uh, I'm interested to hear your results with Vegas 10s. So let me know, or if you have any other stress-relieving, anxiety-relieving techniques, no matter what it is, uh, please share, because, yeah, we could all use less stress and anxiety and more zen. For more techie tips, see scottystech.info. Thanks for watching. See you next time.